Okay. Ooh. I'll be back. Mom, do you want a coffee? Where are you going? Starbucks. You said no. Okay. Having a moment in my slippers, a slipper coffee moment. She's giving abominable snowman vibes. Ow! We're gonna go with my number one played song, Justin Bieber. Anyone, baby. This is giving uh, coronavirus. I used to come to this drive-through during the pandemic when my like my friends and I would get in our own cars and we'd like line up and like talk on the phone like we were hanging out and it'd just be like four cars at this drive-through. Um, welcome back. It's Vlogmas Day Four. I can't believe it. I'm so excited. I'm feeling a tad under the weather today, so I decided to come to a drive-through instead of. Um, a normal Starbucks just in case Yeah, I woke up with a huge headache and I've been coughing a little bit, but I've had COVID before and I don't think this is it I have no idea what today's gonna be because I don't want to really go anywhere Just because of this so We'll see what kind of trouble I get into at home. It might be a boring boring little vlog, but I don't know. Also, I don't know what I'm going to get. I like, definitely came in the wrong entrance, so next time I'll come in the other way. Honestly, you can really just tell in my voice. My voice sounds different than it did yesterday, in my opinion, so... Also, when I'm editing my videos, I'm realizing that I, I say so at the end of a sentence when I don't know what I'm going to say next. And I almost just said it there. So I'm gonna try to not do that because it's kind of annoying. Hi, thanks for choosing Starbucks. What can I get started for you? Hi, can I do a grande cafe latte with vanilla? Sure, anything else for you? Yeah, can I do a butter croissant heated up? Okay. And can I have like a pub cup? Yeah, of course. Just remind us at the window about the pub cup. Okay, awesome. Anything else for you? No, that's it. All right. I would just feel so bad if I got someone sick. You know? What a crazy world we live in, you know? Who would have thought a mask would be a normal thing? I didn't. I wouldn't have. Hi! Hi! Oh, thank you. Thank you. You too. Oh, I couldn't see it, but there was Jesus. There was Jesus. Some Jesus. Are you ready? Sit down. Are you ready? Oh, do you know what this is? You never had one of these before. Okay, ready? Go ahead. Oh, <gasps> it's called a puppetino. And how much did you have to? It's free. That? Oh, it's free. So, so thank you very much. Merry Christmas. <laughs> okay, hi. Um, I'm kind of having a bit of a sick day. I'm not feeling my best. Um, I've just been laying around and I just took a shower and it made me feel a lot better. But I thought um, it might be fun to share my skincare routine. I wash my face with the normal CeraVe. Um, and it works pretty well for my skin. Pretty neutral skin. A lot of things work for it. I don't break out that easily. It's from the Ordinary and it's just the normal 
glycolic acid 7% toning solution and I just put it on one of these and I just put it on and then I like start on one side I don't know I'm not a skin whiz this is just what works for me and the products that I like kind of focusing it on where I've been breaking out recently And then next, I go in with the with it, my serum, which is the hyaluronic acid from The Ordinary as well. Yeah, just the hyaluronic acid from The Ordinary. So I do... Push a little, little drop out. My cheek. My forehead. My nose and underneath. And then I go in just my hands and just like lightly rub it and then press it into my face and then while the serum's still drying I go in with my jade roller and I roll up if I'm feeling bougie I'll go in with my gua sha and then I put a little extra serum on so it doesn't pull at my skin under my eyes and then I'll roll it on my mustache line. Is that what that's called? I'm still on my Laneige water bank moisture cream um, kick right now and I'm almost out so I'm gonna don't need to buy like the full size one. This is still for my birthday. Uh, and I just take like a finger worth of it. And I'll put some on my cheeks, on my forehead, my nose. And underneath and then I'll just rub the rest in and I like to go in a circle in a circular motion I don't know why if that's good for you or bad for you somebody let me know but that's just what I, I did and I didn't even start a skincare routine until like honestly like a year ago because my skin has never really been bad but yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, and then for my hair, I almost always let it air dry unless I have somewhere to be. And then I'll just like try to get any excess water out. But I just start at the bottom and work my way up. Now that that's all combed. And then my hair is really naturally curly. You can kind of see it here. Okay, so the Kristen S Curl Defining Cream. And I just shake it and squeeze out like, I don't know if this is too much, but I have very thick hair, so just about that much. So I just rub it around, and then I just comb through it in my, with my fingers. I just kind of scrunch it, just to define how it dries. I'm just gonna go downstairs and lay on the couch and watch some movies because I'm just not feeling great I just have a headache and my throat is getting a little sore but here's my sick outfit of the day I'm wearing these green sweats are my favorite from Airy and this huge extra large sweatshirt from my friend's family's lake house they made merch and I love it so yeah, I'm gonna go lay around drink some water and try to kick this whatever this thing is before it takes over.